Okay, in this video, I want to take a look at discrimination in the whole area of the provision of goods and services in Ireland. What are your remedies and where can you go? This area is covered when it comes to the provision of goods and services by the Equal Status Act 2000 to 2015. Basically, there are 10 grounds of discrimination in Ireland. These include gender, civil status, race, colour, nationality, family status, sexual orientation, age, membership of the travelling community, disability, religion and housing assistance. The housing assistance one relates to landlords refusing to let residential accommodation to tenants who are in receipt of social welfare payments or who are in receipt of HAP payments. Now these 10 grounds of discrimination also apply with the exception of the housing assistance ground to employment law. So goods and services, there's 10 grounds, employment law, there's nine grounds. The whole thrust of the legislation in relation to goods and services and the Equal Status Acts is to prevent discrimination in relation to the provision of all services. This would include entertainment, banking, transport, travel, accommodation, insurance, and, and so on. Employment-based discrimination then there are nine grounds, so all of the previous ten grounds with the exception of the housing assistance. The relevant legislation in this area is the Employment Equality Act 1998-2015. So where do you go if you've been discriminated against in relation to, for example, insurance or housing uh, accommodation or letting agreements or any other, other goods or services? If you've been discriminated against on the grounds of one of the discriminatory grounds, for example, nationality or race or sexual orientation or whatever, where do you go? You go to the Workplace Relations Commission. Before you do that though, you firstly send a form called an ES1. You get it on the Workplace Relations Commission website. This is a notification that you fill out. You send it to the person against whom you are making the complaint and it'll set out basically the alleged discrimination that you are uh, complaining about. It must be received by the other party within two months of the incident. The other party may reply with a form ES2. If you're not happy with the reply or if you're completely ignored, then you can proceed at that stage to the Workplace Relations Commission. You basically refer your complaint for adjudication to the WRC and that referral must be made within six months of the alleged discrimination. I hope you find this useful. I'm a uh, solicitor in Enfield and County Meath, my details are there. But again, if you have an issue in relation to discrimination, goods and services, you go to the WRC. This might strike you as unusual because normally the WRC only deals with employment stuff, but they have the remit for equality based claims. Hope you find it useful. If you do, give me the thumbs up down below or the video, the th th thumbs up down below. And you might be interested in subscribing to my YouTube channel.